Tusemi kuwa haja huchochea uvumbuzi umedhihirika baada ya taifa hili kuandikisha historia katika matibabu ya saratani kwa kutumia mbinu ya kisasa ya teknolojia bila kuhusisha upasuaji almaarufu Ultra Cyber Knife. Matibabu hayo ambayo ndiyo mwanzo kuanza kutumika humu nchini yalifanyika leo katika hospitali maalum ya mafunzo ya utafiti ya chuo kikuu cha Kinyata katika kaunti ya Kiambu. Ni katika hospitali maalum ya mafunzo na utafiti ya chuo kikuu cha Kinyata. Mwenyekiti wa bodi Profesa Olive Mugenda anaungana na wataalamu na maafisa wa serikali wanatazama kwa makini utaratibu wa mbinu ya kisasa ya matibabu ya kwanza na aina yake humo nchini almaarufu Ultra Cyber Knife. Mbinu hii ya matibabu ya teknolojia ndio ya kwanza isiyohusishwa upasuaji kwa matibabu ya saratani humo nchini na katika kanda hii Kenya ikiwa ya pili barani Afrika baada ya Misri kuitumia mwaka uliopita. Benjamin Muthama mwanafunzi mwenye umri wa miaka 28 na mhandisi wa programu ndiye mgonjwa wa kwanza kufanyiwa matibabu hayo. Benjamin aligunduliwa kuwa na uvimbe baina ya jicho na pua. Dakika 30 baadaye, niafueni furaha na shangwe. Huku Mudhama kiungana na babake Jonathan Mutanga. We then uh, thought of even going to India due to the long wait, but uh, we are happy that uh, we have uh, the machine here in the country. And um, the patient the tumor was It's actually a benign tumor, it's not cancerous at all, but it was very close to the cochlea. This is the hearing apparatus and the brain stem. This is um, the one that helps you do everything that you are able to do as a human being. So of course with this kind of treatment we are able because it's very accurate up to 1 mm of accuracy, we are able to um, evade these critical structures and you can see the patient is actually standing. It also supports universal health care given that it is fully covered by NHIF and patients with NHIF don't have to add any money to access the treatment. Mbinu hii mpya matibabu ya Cyber Knife itawezesha wagonjwa kumi kutibiwa kwa siku moja na tayari wagonjwa mia moja wanasubiri kupokea matibabu. We intend to treat up to 300 patients maybe in the first year of, of this machine being um, up and running course as personnel as a radiation oncologist we are uh, planning to keep on training um, to keep on going for the trainings and a lot of help is coming in from India from the accurate team it does treatment f- with with more than 6000 angles so it hits the tumor from different angles which no else no no other system can do that nimbini ya matibabu ambayo matumizi yake nchini yatapunguza gharama ya matibabu ya saratani wanayogharamia wa Kenya kwenda nje ya nchi Sarafina Rubi Darubini